Hey, how's it going, everybody? Anonymous Disco here. Can you see me up there? You see me over there? <laughs> I wanted to see just how, just how small I can make my, my webcam. But anyways, welcome back to Silent Hill 2. Uh, it it has been uh, a little while since we last played this. Uh, I gotta kind of refamiliarize myself, both with what's kind of going on, and uh, and the controls a little bit. The controls are kind of coming back to me now, but uh, okay. So we got the Cinderella music box, music box with figure from the fairy tale Cinderella, attached, found inside trunk in room two hundred two. So Cinderella, if I remember correctly, Cinderella is the uh, the chick with uh, she gets like banged by the seven dwarves or something. Seat of the princess who awoke from death. Play the music box. Doesn't sound quite right. Is the music box broken, or maybe... Tangular indentation. Uh, there's a plate in front of the indentation, and something is engraved on it. Seat of the princess who awoke from death. Play the music box now. I'm gone. Okay, so we gotta do something with that music box. We gotta, uh, we gotta, um, you know, like get fixed or something. There's a piece missing or some shit. Also, James is right close to dead right now, too. Mind getting a little tasty health antidote. <clears throat> but yeah, um, someone gave me a tip, hot tip. And they said, uh, kind of pay attention to where James is looking. He'll actually kind of like move his head around. And, um, <laughs> so, give me one second. This is weird me out now, too. I'm going to make myself a little bit bigger. Um, I, I, yeah, that looks better. Yeah, there we go. Anyway. <laughs> um, sorry, yeah. So they said a kind of hot tip at, uh, if you kind of look, if you kind of watch where James's head's kind of looking, you can, um, or maybe he'll be like looking at like ammo and kind of like, st you know, items of interest. You do got to be careful around this hotel though, because there's a lot of tough enemies. They're like those like mattress. Mattress men. 
I like from what I remember. Oh yeah, there's one there. I think I I think I took him out though. But still gotta be careful. Oh they're both dead. Okay, still. They can come back at any second. It's funny, um I just finished playing or not just finished, but recently finished playing uh, Signalis and uh awesome game. Highly recommend it to anybody who likes survival horror, but it's just funny, you know, you go back and play Silent Hill and you just realize like just how much this genre owes to it and it's, you know, Resident Evil, Silent Hill and stuff, like how much they coined. Okay, now I'm pretty sure this is where I saw Laura. A drawing done by Laura. A cat? There's a piano here. I remember how much Mary liked to play piano. She wasn't very good, but I still loved to hear her play. That was so long ago, before we were even married. What am I thinking about it now? I don't know. But it's a little rude of you to say she wasn't very good. What the fuck do you know, James? What the fuck do you know about music? He played a knife and fork, that's all. Nothing much of interest. I can go out that door either. It's a really cool location. I like the empty, the abandoned kind of hotel by the water. It's really fucking creepy, actually. God damn it, I'm going around in circles. Okay, um, reception, restaurant. Doesn't look like I've been in any of those rooms yet. Like these ones over here, the 1, 108, and 10, and 11. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, O, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. I think I forgot the letter I when I was doing the health right there. That's why I never graduated high school. Because I'm illiterate. <laughs> you figured me out, man. Alright. These locks are broken. Yeah, the elevator's broken. Um, I guess that one room it just says that the I could use a key if I had a key for it. And it's this one. It's locked. What room is it? Does it say? I don't know what room it is.
Didn't know if it was in the game or not. I heard something. I get so paranoid when I play horror games, man. I keep thinking I'm like, I'm actually hearing something. I guess it's my cat snoring. She's really loud. I don't know if you can hear that, it's a PS3 running. It's uh it's definitely showing its age a bit. PlayStation 3. It's a shame too, because I was looking at like it has such a good library of games. It might even be my favorite console, the PlayStation 3, but Top of the Desk. Looks like a medical book. I've already read enough medical books. None of them ever did any good. Oh, okay. Okay. I already opened it. There's nothing in the bag. I think... Sorry, I'm, uh, I kind of forgot what I did last time, too. So, I'm just... Can't hear anything from the receiver. Could the phone line possibly be cut? Yeah, most likely. No one my luck. <laughs> no one my luck that the receiver is cut. Guys are dead too. For now. Uh Guard man, <laughs> so noisy. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm dead. It's not a big deal. I'm just looking around. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck to do. Take another look here. Three twelve is the room Mary and I stayed in three years ago. So I got the music box, the Cinderella music box. Take it. Might as well. Doesn't hurt. Hmm. 
um, no sir, I can. Don't think there's anything I can combine it with, or can't leave the hotel just yet. All right. Need to figure out how to get over here. That's like the area I haven't explored yet. And I bet it's got whatever, I don't know. I have to fix this music box or tune it or something. Ooh. Do you want gravy with that? I'm pretty sure we've been down in the basement, but I'll take another look. Look at James's dumb face. Like, it's just this dumb stare right at you. Hey. My name's James. I got a dead wife. How the fuck are you? Ah! <laughs> I already found Yeah, my name's James. My uh my wife is dead. Pretty cool, right? No. Okay, so there's men and women's bathroom that are closed. There's the elevator. And how do you scroll between maps? Get out of my way. Ugh, I'm dead. Oh, it'd be nice if I found a fucking health potion more sitting around just sitting around like a apple like a freshly sliced apple in honey for dipping <laughs> but it also it also seems like it has something to do with getting that elevator online Cause if I could, does that even have like an elevator shaft? There's one there. How do you? Okay, I gotta. I wanna cycle through the maps. Uh, map. I wanna cycle through them. Damn it. I'm just thinking if I could wait a second. Cause there's this I don't wanna go that way. Cause as you can see, like there's a reception. There's like the door that goes to reception. Can't get outside from there, but like it looks like there's a whole other section there. Another section to do something. That's the basement. I kind of want to get back in the basement because if I can get to that bar, it looks like I haven't been in the kitchen yet, and then there's another door which could potentially lead to something. I don't know if I have seen that. 
Then there's this whole other left side of the first floor I haven't been to. And yeah, then there's the whole other like second floor. I really haven't done anything on the right side. Which if maybe if I can get this elevator working or something that would help. I don't I don't know. It doesn't really seem like the elevator necessarily goes anywhere and that I can see that I need to go, that I haven't been already, but I don't know. That's how you play the game, man. I'm going the right way. Because I want to go right. Hey. Sorry, excuse me. So the bar is locked. I need the I need a key to the bar. That's why I can't get in there. These are the bathrooms, can't get in there. Fuck my ass. Why don't you just fuck my ass? It's no good because I've already been there, done, been there, done that. This is a bunch of bullshit. God, I haven't been here yet. A little bit of good luck. Or have I been here? Because that thing's dead. Oh, I'll look around. Toilet paper. I don't need that right now. Well, you never know when you do. Laundry cart. There's nothing useful inside. Fuck. Okay, maybe I have been here. Shit on my balls. Fuck. I said, why don't you just shit on my balls? Because that's what you're doing to me. Just shit on, you're just shitting on my balls, aren't you? I can't say anything about it.
Oh, I can leave the hotel? What was all this hogwash about, like, I can't leave the hotel right now? Maybe I can approach it from a... They're a different angle. So I can kind of get to a different area, maybe? I can't leave the hotel right now. Sorry, was there something on there? There's a fountain in the shape of a bird. No water is coming out of it right now. The, look, at the, there's a music box. Okay. Thank you, Jameson. We might have just cracked this code wide open. We might have just cracked this bitch wide open. Like getting milk from a coconut. We just cracked it way open. All right, all right, all right. Oh, hold up, hold up. Little Mermaid. Okay, so I don't, I didn't grab the Cinderella the other time around, but. I don't know if I need like three music bosses or what the story is, but uh, we got another one. We're getting a little bit closer. A little bit closer. Uh, how do you get back to the lobby? Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Get ourselves a snack. <laughs> Seat of the princess who awoke from death. Play the music box. So, uh, Seed of the Princess Who Woke from Death. I don't think that's either Little Mermaid or Cinderella is the thing. Because I think that would be Sleeping Beauty. Right? Um, but... Put down the Little Mermaid music box. Can I like place them at Wait, wait, wait. Did that say something different? Oh, they do. So okay, so it's where where do you have them placed? Okay, seat of the princess who spoke no words. I don't know these fucking spoke no words. Woke from death sounds like sleeping beauty. So seat of the princess who fled at midnight. That's Cinderella. Okay. That's someone Cinderella. We'll take that one. Flood at midnight. No. Okay. So what do we need to do now? Is use Cinderella there. Okay. So Cinderella flood at midnight. 
Who spoke no words? Little did Little Mermaid speak no words? I I don't know. I'll put it there for the time being. I'm just glad we're fucking. Something's actually happening now. Little Mermaid. Okay, and then there has to be there has to be like a Sleeping Beauty one around. One time. But where? Does this say anything? Mr. James Sunderland. The videotape you forgot here is being kept in the office on the first floor. The office of the first floor, you say. Mm, why don't you just get a little stink on my balls then? I said I'm trying to stink up my own balls here at all. <laughs> Where's the office of the first lady? Is it... Is it... Is it reception? I pulled out my balls. She said, why do they smell so bad? I said, hey, why don't you chill the fuck out? to crack on this thing, man. We're so close. There's a bell here. Even if I ring it, I don't think anyone will come. take a look at 202 and 204 again make sure I didn't miss anything there's not another music box or some shit in there some dirty junk Jesus Christ hard to look around when you got these these jokers Fuck oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I already opened that bag. I'll take one last look in there. It's these dirty ding dongs getting in my way of doing what I need to do. It's so cool how they move around like that. They s scatter along the floor. Alright. All good. Actually, I should have saved it after I put the music boxes down, but whatever. I know where the other one is. So there's going to be a third one around or something. Because that's all I can... That's all I can think of. But anyways, it's outside, so let's go grab that. And then... I don't know. It's gotta, it's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe in the restaurant where Laura was. That was freaky.
Just taking one last look around, making sure I don't miss anything. Be real nice if I got the. I know I've said it already, but it's something to heal up with. These enemies are just one shot me, dude. Okay, so this is, I'm gonna put the Little Mermaid here. And this is the one who fled at midnight. Yep. Now let's throw a save on it just so when I inevitably die again, I will have to do it again. They're locked that way. I already went down. There was nothing. Slobby is the ba 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 ba. Make sure there isn't like a music box or something sitting around this this area. Trust. Can't get out those doors. missing I don't think anything was down in the basement This way, like, I mean, I looked in those two rooms where there's, like, the things are that keep killing me. I think I've already done everything that I need to do in there. So I don't think that's it.
in the reading room. We're gonna read a book in the reading room. In the reading room. Hey, 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 we're in the reading room. Don't worry. Uh, okay. Nothing really. <sighs> the cloak room, but I'm pretty sure I already opened up. It was... I think that's maybe where I got the Cinderella music box or whatever. Yeah, I've already opened up this case. In the reading room. There's really any more. That one's locked. I don't have the key for. When you go down to the elevator downstairs, does it say anything? Like, is it like, does it need something or? I feel like it's something so fucking simple, too. But, like, I've just... missed. And it's gotta be, like, sitting on one of these chairs, and it's just like you've walked past it, like, ten fucking times, dude. I love the mannequin uh, uh, enemies. They're really neat. They're definitely one of the neatest, scariest in the game. Jesus, tired. There's another one right there. I think a million shots. So you don't mind me wasting all my ammo on you, do ya? Now I can hear myself think. Venus tears. It's locked. Okay. Um. That nothing is. Uh, what's what is happening? 
With his elevator, man. Nothing's happening with this freaking elevator. I went into that bar. Wait, wait, wait. There's something. They're trying to tell me something. Some X marks the spot. You see that X on the wall? I think I'm about to tap into something. Painting is hanging here. There's nothing unusual about it. Well, shit. All right, well, that's the basement. Fuck. Fuck. God damn it. I don't know, man. I don't, I don't know. I'm lost. I'm lost. Music box, Cinderella, Snow White. Snow White. Is Snow White sleeping the I don't fucking know. Blog, exploring, insert them in the correct places. Blah, 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 blah. Must be she. didn't tell me anything. Snow White. That's the one I need. It's one of the three. Blah, blah, blah. You can find the music box in the pantry in the employee's only area. In the pantry of the employee's only area? What the fuck is that? Where, uh, where's the employees only area? Or better yet, how the fuck do you get to the employees only area?
Okay, so it says that if I go to room 204, on the desk, there's a key to the employees only elevator. So I must have just missed that. Either missed that or, or, or something. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Which way are we going here? This way? Oh man, sorry I had to go walk through. I know it's a little uh, uh, mischievous, but uh, I was just kind of a little getting a little lost there, man. We were close. We were close to it. But. And it's one of those things, too. Like, it's not, I didn't necessarily even have to look up a walkthrough to the puzzle. It's just one of those things. Like, sometimes you just miss shit. And it's, a, it's on me. I'm not blaming the game or anything. Just sometimes you just miss a little item, so. Okay, okay, okay. Just chill out. There. Okay, yeah, okay, that's all it was. That's all I fucking missed. That fucking key. The employee only elevator key. That's all it fucking was. Ugh, okay, sorry. That's all I had to look up the walkthrough for, man. I just had to get that fucking key. The rest. I don't know. We may have to use the walkthrough again. I don't know. We'll see. We'll cross that bridge when we get there. But I'm so glad we have that key now. But it's one thing, I don't know, you really gotta, like I said, like that tip that guy gave me about, um, just always kind of like looking where, looking where James is looking is, uh, is a important one just cause, um, you can really easily, easily miss stuff. Okay, now that I got the key, let's actually go to an elevator, see if we can use one. By the way, by the way, I get so disoriented in this game, too. Because I think it's kind of like... Supposed to be like that. Supposed to be kind of disorienting. But also... Um, I just, like... I, I'm terrible with, like, direction. I'm terrible with everything, really. Okay. These guys are... Maybe I'll try the elevator down here. No, okay, so the key doesn't the key doesn't work here. Okay. Fuck. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Use the employee elevator key. Yum, yum, yum. There we are. There we are. Another save. 
And I save a roo and we're laughing. We are laughing. Oh, fuck yeah. And some health drinks. That's exactly what I wanted. Anything else? Okay. Let's go. Whoa. Uh, that's freaky. Uh, there is something written over the button. What's this? Weight allowance, one person. Hey, is it the picture of Mary? Is it tech? No. Oh, I was being so clever. I thought it was like, oh, he's carrying, he's carrying the picture of, of Mary, and it's like carrying another person. It's this big fucking sword I'm carrying. Do we put everything on the shelf? Do I put everything on the shelf? Yeah, uh, what about... I'm sure the shotgun's pretty heavy. Oh, fuck me. I'm going to just at least try to keep my handgun and bullets. Nope. Okay, I don't have a single thing on me now. Okay. You can't go down with anything. Alright. Uh, okay, basement doesn't work. First floor works. I don't have a map of this area. Fuck. Oh, there we go. Ah, hotel map for employees. I don't even have a flashlight. Shit. God damn. I'm real. Down into the darkness. There are apples and pumpkins here. There are potatoes and onions here. They smell slightly rotten. Ah, the Snow White music box. <laughs> Looks like it's all come together. Okay, the office is where apparently the videotape, the sex tape Mary and I made been left all the employees been fucking jerking off to like this is good shit this whole it's well filmed 
guy's pretty hung. He's really going at her, eh? Where am I? This guy's kind of hung like a fucking donkey, eh? Holy shit. I don't know where I am. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's, let's give that a second. Before I go too deep into there. It's too dark to read the map. Silent Hill. It's the name of the game. Alright. There's a can opener beneath the videotape. I got the can opener. Good, good, good. We can use that. Now, where to play the videotape, I wonder. I wonder. Where I gotta play that tape? Wonder, wonder. Okay. There's a scheduled book here. The date is from one year ago. Yeah, the laundry room is the only ones I didn't explore. I didn't look in those bathrooms either. Maybe that's locked there. So I can't get to the manager's office as far as I can see. But we got the um this uh whatever the fuck her name is. Snow White uh, music box. So we can do that. We can put the music box in the thing and then do it and have fun listening to music. Music. Let's see where that leads us. Can I not go back up? Am I, am I trapped here forever? Jimmy? Jimmy, Jimmy, what's going on, man? Wait, can I just go that way? Can I open it up there, like, and just, so I don't have to take the elevator every time? Hold up. Is this the door? <coughs> Fuck. Kick it down, then, James. You, you weakling. You just, you, do you have any idea how angry? Do you have any idea the amount of frustration you cause me? Do you have any idea? Alright, I guess we gotta go this way then. I'll just try to... Now, at 1.2, someone commented said there was like a... There actually is like a, a block or something that you can... I don't know how the... F how the fuck... Uh, I don't want to adjust the controls. I just want to know what the controls are. 
action run guard square okay all right <laughs> Oh, that was pretty easy to dodge him anyway. Pretty loud in there, eh? Oh, med kit. Oh, I'll use that. I can use that, baby. Oh, that's good shit. Give me back to a hundred. Oh, a key. Bar key. Nice. I can use that, too. Get all kinds of goodies. Can you give me those goodies? Can you give me those goodies? Okay. So, Jay, chill out. Chill out, man. Can you give me those goodies? Can you give me those tasty treats? Can you give me those goodies? Oh, there's two of them. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is fucked. What's this? There are empty wine bottles there. Wine. Can you give me some goodies? Ooh. <gasps> I could use my can opener, but I fucking had to put it in the shelf. So I'll have to establish a way of getting from the employees area to the hotel without taking that elevator or some shit. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck my ass. Hey, it's James the bartender, man. He looks good behind a bar. It's on the old jukebox. Fucking James is the most useless tit. He's like, this fucking jukebox is broken. Oh, there's no bulb and this light. Can't turn that on. Sorry. He's like, why don't you try and fucking fixing something for us? It's too dark to find a keyhole. Oh, if we'll feel around a bit. Feel around a little bit, man. I don't know what you want me to tell you. Just feel it. Just touch it. Use the light from the jukebox. Fuck. God fucking damn it. It's too dark to find the keyhole. You know how many times like I come home from my apartment and it's fucking dark and I can't see? Usually I'll use my phone in all fairness, but like I could find the keyhole if it was dark. Come on, don't give me that shit, James. Fuck. Useless boob. The boob strikes again. Can you give me some goodies? Can you give me a tasty treat? I just want some goodies. I just want something yummy to eat. Well... I'm gonna have to find something, some kind of source of light. So the bar key was there. Can I get the bulb? Like, what about the bulb that's in there? 
Why don't you take the bulb that's in there? Why don't you take the light bulb out of there, James? Hey? Why don't you take the light bulb out of there, dude? I want. Why don't you just listen to me? I gotta stop doing that, I'm sorry. No one's when nothing happens, right? <whistles> sorry. There's got to be, um, something around here. A bulb. There has, to, there has to be, like, a bulb. What's this? What's this? What's all this? What's this junk? Oh, that's the, oh, into the, okay. All right. Is there anything else in here? So is the reason why I can't go and use the elevator now is because I have shit on me too? Like, because I have stuff? Too heavy? This is where the had the Cinderella music box. I wonder Examine. Silent Hill is written on. I have a can opener. Oh fuck, I already have a can opener and I didn't I thought it was in the sh oh, okay. I bet we're gonna open that can up. We're gonna open that can up, and it's gonna there's gonna be like a a light bulb in the can. So if we go over here and I use the can opener, oh yeah, oh yeah, light bulbs in a can, I knew it. It's like fucking Patrick when he's, he's like, a light bulb, he's like, but why does it have to be so high? And he's like, the mountain of light bulbs, just get the one that's in use. It's just, uh... 
Kind of giggly, kind of silly. Silly stuff, silly stuff. There's a lamp on the corner. There's a lamp. But there's no light bulb, so I can't turn it on. Okay, we'll use the light bulb. Yum, yum, diggity. I use the bar key. Well, that's a yum, yum dinner. Whoa, they're back up. I love how they just stay still like that, though. It is really cool. Okay, so now I gotta run past this fucker. See you later. Now I can get in and out. I then I don't have to use the elevator. Oh, we're laughing, baby. We're laughing. Okay, I'll go put. Actually, before anything else, I'm gonna go save it. And I'll put the Cinderella in there. We'll see what happens. I imagine we're going to get, like, a key to something. Right, because he can't see anything without his fucking flashlight. I'll just go get my shit before we do anything else. Which way was it? Is it this way? Hey guys. Nice party, why wasn't I invited? Retrieve everything from the shelf, yes. You know what I want. You know how I like it. Is that the right way? Which way? I guess I, I'm sorry. I get so disoriented when I play this game. Uh, uh, I think it's this way. Shab Lagoo. So Snow White awoke from death, and then the other ones. Yes, it should work now. They all should be in the right order. It's a beautiful tune. Hotel Stairway Key. Beautiful. Okay, so the hotel stairway key would be um Is it just like when you go up to the third floor and that's locked on the third floor? I wonder. Is that just gonna keep playing? Somebody turn that shit off. Let me 
turn that junk off? Yep. Okay, cool. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So it was Mary and I's room 304, 312. Let's see. Uh, 312. And uh, which way was that? <laughs> uh, like I'm right beside it. Is this 312? All right, let's go. Here's the end of the game. Oh, I remember this room. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. A lot of memories. This brings back a lot of memories. Yeah, well, I think I gotta watch the videotape in here. There's a VCR. It looks like I'll be able to use it. There's a television here, even when it's plugged in. Oh. Okay, whatever. Use. Can't use it here. Can't use that here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Put the tape in. Put the bloody tape in. see what's on it let me see it are you taping again come on uh, I don't know why but I just love it here it's so peaceful you know what I heard this whole area used to be a sacred place I think I can see why uh, it's too bad we have to leave Please promise you'll take me again, James. <laughs> Whoa. What the fuck? Is this actually the end of the game? Probably not. No, there's no way. Or it's if it is, it's like Whoa. I'm so on edge. So there you are, James. Did you get the letter? Did you find Mary? If not, let's get going. Okay?
Uh, now the hotel's become like nightmare zone. So, yeah, so, I mean, we've come to the realization now that, that James killed Mary, which seemed, uh, you know, we were kind of thinking that for a little while, right? Like that he was, uh, that he was the killer. And that kind of everybody in Silent Hill has, like, is a, is a murderer of some kind. Um, and that, that this place, Silent Hill, is almost kind of like this, um, this kind of purgatory for them to, to kind of work out their, work out their, their, their junk, their shit. And I think, like, maybe Laura and Maria kind of represent different sides of Mary. Like, different, like, Mary, like, as a child, and Mary, and then there's kind of, like, Mary, Maria is more like the... Maybe what he wanted Mary to always be like, maybe what he kind of... What he kind of... Yeah, the, the the attractiveness the sexiness of her you know i don't know yeah i'm just i'm, I'm just kind of verbal diary and i'm trying to work it out but uh yeah i don't know that would be the end that's really weird it's like i went in through that door and then i just came out on the other end of that door This place is really confusing. Okay, I can't. Fuck, this is so confusing. Like, you just... You never end up in the same spot. Okay. Um, hold up. Here we go. Okay, now I'm on the other end. It's really cool music that's playing. Press the switch, but nothing happens. I press.
filling up with water. Okay, now I'm back in the bar. I wonder if anyone in real life has like recreated the the Silent Hill, this Silent Hill hotel, um, to come and like stay at. <laughs> I go stay there, especially if it's just like you know it's actually like a nice hotel too. It's like yeah, we got nice facilities and we got nice. Uh, uh, we're coming up on a big boss fight. First aid. Just as long as I need to let, let me add a maybe a a savey. Save square. There wasn't a sway save square back there, was there? We're definitely gonna have to fight Pyramid Face once and for all. And it's it's we're we're probably gonna be him. Maybe? Question mark? I don't know. He's gonna be like, ah, oh, you're a fucking killer. You sick fuck. Get her. Just let me buy him. Ugh, can't get by this fucking stupid. Idiots. These idiots, man. Imbeciles. Oh fuck, what is that? Ball, ball, ball. That's so freaky. Fuck man, Silent Hill still holds up as just like, uh, really just, you know, putting you on the edge of your seat and. Oh, it's that girl from before. When I think was like touched by her dad. Mama. Maybe the only one left. Maybe then. Maybe then I can rest. Mama, why are you running away? <gasps> You're not my mama. It's it's you. Angela, no. Thank you for saving me. But I wish you hadn't. Even Mama said it. I deserved what happened. No, Angela, that's wrong. Maybe we should have this conversation outside. It's not Maybe on fire. You think you can save me? Will you love me? Take care of me? Heal all my pain? <laughs> That's what I thought. Right, because I've been carrying her knife around this whole time. I, I won't. Save for yourself. No, I never kill myself. It 
it's hot as hell in here. Do you see it too? For me, it's always like this. I can't do anything. Do I have to use the knife? Can't use that here. Hmm. Interesting, okay. I can't follow her out though. Is that how he did it? He like burned the house down or something? Burning down the house. Oh yeah, I remember those guys with the fucking suction cup dudes. Is this it? Is this our final battle? Let this be our final battle. I wonder uh, if this would be effective against them at all. You gotta move a little bit faster, buddy. I guess it's pretty heavy, eh? Thank you. 
that doing anything against them? The, so you can hear like bouncing off their helmets. All right, I'll just keep shooting them, I guess. I just like is that doing anything against them? That doing anything for you there? Let's hit him with the big, the big boy uh, guns now. Oh, I like that gun. How do you know I like that gun? Ah, fuck. Oh, well, it takes so fucking long to shoot and reload it. He's getting fucking smacked by the time. It's better off with the pistol. It's a little quicker. Is there a reason there's an X on the map, too? I feel like there's just something I'm missing to this boss fight. What else I gotta be doing? As I press the switch when nothing ha- Oh, it's, it's just this flashlight, okay. I don't know if there's like... Something else I gotta do with this boss fight. Or just keep shooting at these guys. It just doesn't seem like nothing's really working against them. Cause even then, like, I get that you like, they got the big mass, but even then it's just like, it's kinda hard to get behind them. Even if you want to shoot them that way. Fuck, I'm like empty. A million bullets into these dudes.
Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Are they dead? I don't need you anymore. There's a round indentation in the door. Pyramid head won't move anymore. Rusted colored egg. Pyramid head won't move anymore. It looks like he's holding something. I got a scarlet egg. There's a round indentation in the door. Okay, so I don't know which one. Let's just take a look at these eggs. They're the size of a quail's egg. Okay. Okay, so I got the red egg in there. Put the rest of the egg in the other one. saying look i'm disgusted i don't deserve flowers between the disease and the drugs i look like a monster well, what are you looking at get the hell out of here leave me alone already i'm no use to anyone i'll be dead soon anyway maybe today maybe tomorrow but it'd be easier if they'd just kill me I guess the hospital is making a nice profit off me. They want to keep me alive. Are you still here? I told you to go. You deaf. Don't come back. James. Wait. Please don't go. Stay with me. Don't leave me alone. I didn't mean what I said. Please, James. Me, I'll be okay. Tell me I'm not going to die. Help me. Hmm. That's sad. So did that is that what it is? He euthanized her? Put her out of her misery? Or is it something else? Cause it also she says she doesn't want to die. Like first she's like, well I'm better off dead. And then, I don't know. Trippy stuff. We're definitely right at the end of this. I know. Pyramid head's dead. This is a really cool part. Prism? Are you there? Oh. Mary? Wrong again. Mary's dead. You killed her. Maria? Maria? I'm 
done with you. What do you mean? But I can be yours. I'll be here for you forever. And I'll never yell at you or make you feel bad. That's what you wanted. Now I understand. The problem is, you're not married. No chance. I won't let you. I'll never let you have your Mary back. Bats. Okay, yes, we're the bats. Killed me. Fuck. Oh, fuck, do I have to fight the pyramid heads again? everybody uh so sorry about the trouble there i uh during my kind of like th third fight with maria the computer kind of caught out on me i had to anyways i had to fight her a few more times that boss fight was fucking oh it was pissing me off but we got, got it beat um so anyways here we go i just paused it uh james yeah james so she's saying James, and I think I gotta finish her off. James. <sighs> yeah, this is that boss fight. It was just like that. I only had the shotgun left, and the shotgun's just so slow, and then she keeps getting you with those, like, bats or whatever that fly off her. So, anyways, I, uh. The computer kind of ran out of space to record, and I had to kind of go. Very figure all that out so kind of cut out and i had to finish the boss fight anyways all good let's watch the thrilling conclusion forgive me i told you that i wanted to die james i wanted the pain to end that's why i did it honey i just couldn't watch you suffer <laughs> No, that's not the whole truth. You also said that you didn't want to die. The truth is, part of me hated you for taking away my life. You killed me, and you're suffering for it. It's enough, James.
now I understand the real reason I came to this town. I wonder, what was I afraid of? Without you, Mary, I've got nothing. Now, we can be together. In my restless dreams, I see that town. Silent Hill. You promised you'd take me there again someday. But you never did. Well, I'm alone there now. In our special place. Waiting for you. Waiting for you to come to see me. But you never do. And so I wait, wrapped in my cocoon of pain and loneliness. I know I've done a terrible thing to you. Something you'll never forgive me for. I wish I could change that. But I can't. I feel so pathetic and ugly laying here, waiting for you. Every day I stare up at the cracks in the ceiling, and all I can think about is how unfair it all is. The doctor came today. He told me I could go home for a short stay. It's not that I'm getting better. It's just that this may be my last chance. I think you know what I mean. Even so, I'm glad to be coming home. I've missed you terribly. But I'm afraid, James. I'm afraid you don't really want me to come home. Whenever you come see me, I can tell how hard it is on you. I don't know if you hate me or pity me, or maybe I just disgust you. I'm sorry about that. When I first learned that I was going to die, I just didn't want to accept it. I was so angry all the time, and I struck out at everyone I loved most, especially you, James. That's why I understand if you do hate me. I want you to know this, James. I'll always love you. Even though our life together had to end like this, I still wouldn't trade it for the world. We had some wonderful years together. <laughs> Well, this letter has gone on too long, so I'll say goodbye. I told the nurse to give this to you after I'm gone. That means that as you read this, I'm already dead. I can't tell you to remember me. But I can't bear for you to forget me. These last few years since I became ill, I am so sorry for what I did to you, did to us. You've given me so much, 
and I haven't been able to return a single thing. That's why I want you to live for yourself now. Do what's best for you, James. James, you made me happy. All right, so there it was. That's uh, Silent Hill 2. My first playthrough, first time ever beating Silent Hill 2. Um, great ending, cool ending. I, 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 I think like we were speculating for a long time, we knew that James Lake was the killer. He was the, the guy who uh, killed her. But to kind of put the twist... I, I thought it was just going to be like he was... He's crazy, but I think they kind of put the twist in that he was actually, he was kind of like euthanizing his wife and didn't want her to suffer anymore. But also kind of having the, the kind of the ambiguity there where it was just like, well, yeah, he did it because she was suffering, but she also said she didn't want to die. And he also does admit in the end that he was just like, I had a part of me did hate you for for taking part of my life away, for being a burden, for being, a, uh, I guess, and, you know. It's a lot of layers, a lot to think about with that one. And I, I, I do know that there are multiple endings as well. I think they have a lot to do with the other people in Silent Hill, so like Angela. We got to see a little bit of Angela. And, <clears throat> like I said, that's the only Silent Hill game I played too. So, um... I don't know. I actually, on this HD collection, I have Silent Hill 3. So I think I am going to go and fire up Silent Hill 3 and play that uh, after this. But yeah, I I guess just, just looking at it, like I don't know any much lore about Silent Hill. But I, I guess it, it kind of represents this place where you kind of... Like it could be a purgatory of some kind. But I, it's weird because James is actually like he's living... He leaves in the end, too, in his car with Mary's body. So it could actually be, like, a real place. And not just in his head. Because there's other people there, too. But it almost seems like it's this place where, like... You kind of work through your... You kind of work through your, uh... Your baggage, if you will, I guess. And your, uh... Your emotional trauma and you either make it out alive or you don't and I guess it maybe it kind of represents almost like this kind of uh, this judgment maybe even like this kind of like maybe you can make it out of Silent Hill and keep on living or you die there and you kind of you you kind of go to hell or something I don't know Lots to think about, that. Lots of layers. And I also, like, I didn't... I, I'm sure I did not see everything that was in that game, too. Like, I, I think there was a lot of... A lot of letters. A lot of, um... You know, notes and shit written. Um... To see and to think about. So, anyways. Um... Fucking cool game, man. Like, classic survival horror. You can see why it's revered as such a classic. Like... So many uh, silent uh, survival horrors that you play afterwards, like it, are so uh, inspired. It, you know, just have the same DNA that that Silent Hill does. Um, oh, there's my score. So I played on normal ending. I got the in water ending. Uh, ending clear one of four. So there's four endings, I guess. Okay. Uh, save 62, total time. Took me eight hours. Just under nine hours, yeah.
boat stage time. Boat max speed. Why? I wonder what the significance of the boat is. You're ranked two stars. Or is it, do I get all the stars? Or it's a two out of four, six, eight, nine. Well, that's not the best score. Um, but yeah, you can see, like you said, like how, how much of like, a survival horror is, is in its DNA, like it, that it shows throughout other games. Um, I'm excited to see a remake of it, though. I, I think, like, there's, there's definitely a lot of good they could do with the remake because uh you know even things like in that last boss fight you know it's just you know there's things that feel so like old now um where it's just like yeah they you know they could update the combat and um update like just just little things like uh you know just the menu system and and just make it a little bit more streamlined and uh, uh, just a more modern, like those quality of life improvements to the game, but also it's it's kind of a gamble as well because I think you know the game has such a unique style that I, it, it's it's gonna be hard to recreate it. Also, like it's one of those things too. Like as as time goes on, it feels like such a timeless game because like it gets creepier as as time goes on. Like it's almost like now it's now it's become this kind of cool kind of retro plays with your nostalgia a little bit type game, um, and we all know like things like you know Signalis and the kind of like that low poly horror has become so popular. So you could see that even the the original Silent Hill two has got to have this kind of renaissance. Um, yeah, man. So I don't know. I I definitely gotta play the remake when it comes. I think this year. Uh, definitely gotta play that. But you know, we'll see. And I'm really happy that now I've actually played the original, and I won't just be playing the remake and have you know have that be my first experience with Silent Hill too. So, anyways, I I do appreciate uh, you watching all these videos uh, and and watching me on my Silent Hill Two journey. Thank you for commenting and giving tips and all that. Uh, if you're one of the ones to do that, uh, like and subscribe on the video. I really appreciate it. And uh, I'll be back with more games very soon. Um, probably I don't know when, but I I will. I do plan on playing Silent Hill Three. So stay tuned for that. Anyways, everyone, peace out. Have a good rest of your night. Talk to you later.